ordinary competitions, how important are they to the industry? Can we sustain the number of them? And should we expect the government to fund some of them for us? I'm Paul Wilson, the editor of Restaurant Magazine, and these are some of the questions that we'll be debating in the roundtable discussion that follows in partnership with Nestle. Well, I think competitions are extremely important. Uh, I, I always say that every chef needs to do uh, competition in the, in the beginning of their career as a junior, uh, you know, just for the sake of getting into it and being competitive. And then another one at the, at the top end, you know, uh, when they're more mature at sous chef level and so on, and they can really make themselves a good name for that. Uh, the rest of the world is looking at the UK, saying that that's where the best restaurants are. And I really feel that the government should do more in supporting the industry in general, but also for competitions. Why is it important to you that the UK wins the Boku's door? <laughs> Tongue in cheek, I've been in it for 20 years, it's important to me because then I can retire. Once we've won it, there's no farther I can go. But, but what I think it is, it's, it's an opportunity, it's a vehicle for telling the world just what our training, what our gastronomy, what our cooking, what our restaurants, our hospitality industry is all about. And people will notice suddenly, did you see that? The UK have actually won the Poker's Dot, they've beaten the French. And that was tell them so many things about our industry and about the good food that we serve in this country these days. It's really a clarion call to the world. Do you think we have too many culinary competitions and do you think there should be some streamlining of them? Uh, I wouldn't say there's too many, but what I would say is it's to, it's to have a situation where we sponsor the right things because if we spread the money too thin we can't help the the right things and I, I don't want to say that there's totally too many competitions but I, I wouldn't like to see more just put on with more pressure and thinning thinning everything down um, because you know we complain about training and it does help a lot in training we complain about our, our work experience as far as training is concerned we complain about the colleges and quite honestly it's our responsibility and there's not enough people actually taking that responsibility and saying well hold on let me do something let me help and train let me do something so I, I'm a great believer in that so I just think that's pushing it forward we've got one of the biggest industries in this country and not only that it actually reaffirms that we're not all bad we've got a lot of good to sing about uh, if if we prove to be very very good in gastronomy it helps bring people to this country and if it's for nothing else that's a good enough reason for me so there you have it a consensus that competitions are great for the industry and for the chefs that take part in them but there's also a feeling that budgets are coming under increasing pressure and there's a need to streamline the number of them. And it's time the government did more. <laughs>